Yo, what is up, you guys? I'm DeAndre. I'm Javante. And this is Dre and Jay, here today to give you our quick thoughts on Halo Episode 2. Oh, I should the hell up now. You got mad at me while I was singing that, ex- so I was singing that song from X trying to explain it. So now That's because you couldn't sing the shit. You couldn't either. All right, go ahead. Um... So yeah, share some quick thoughts on Halo Episode 2, um, you know, Halo the series, uh, now, streaming on Paramount+. Plus. Not to cut you off, for anybody who doesn't know, we are not a Halo expert, so when we talk about Halo, it's from a video game, some, some video game Some sample. limited yeah, playing video game, experience. Stuff like that, yeah. But go ahead, continue. Um, damn, where did I go with this episode? I mean, this episode didn't have as much action as the first episode i'll say that for sure like there was barely any action in it at all if i'm being honest um more i guess world building story building character building um you know master chief and i can't even think of her damn name you know the the what's it called the survivor from the first episode you know from her colony and Basically, they travel to this planet, uh, starts off, Master Chief, well, the episode actually starts off with a flashback, Master Chief uh, and his friend Solaris, who were in the academy together, I guess, and then Solaris ended up dipping. Master Chief told that man he got five minutes before he reports them, so. What, Quan? Huh? Quan, yes, Quan Ha, that's, that's her name. But, um, so that friendship dynamic is already shaky off, sh- off to a shaky start between, um, Master Chief and Solaris. That's his name, right? Solaris. The black dude? Yeah. Uh, his name's Soren. Soren. God. Wow. 066. Zorin. Yeah, Soren. Um, so yeah, he visits his planet. He's chilling. He has, like, this whole colony established. Um, and then... They're over here going over the artifact, and pretty much, they're just, we'll just stick with that. Yeah, they go over the artifact. Meanwhile, the USNC, yes, USNC, they're investigating the whole Master Chief thing, why he went AWOL, um, you know, about the artifact uh, by Dr. Halsey. She's investigating that as well. Mm -hmm. Um, The Covenant, you know, you have that Covenant leader Mm -hmm. who's a human. She apparently is setting out on a mission to I she's retrieve human. the I artifact. I don't think she's human. I think she's a human. I think she she's human, human, but I don't know if she's human. Because the way um, at the end when she's like taking off her clothes and like taking off her arm thing, she like looks at her hand and shit. It's like, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. It's like she's human. Maybe she's human, but like, I don't know. Maybe she's like, I don't know. Yeah. But, um, go ahead. You can tell you Um, And all for, for, I'm just going to let you know this for all those people who hated Master Chief taking off his helmet <laughs> in that first episode. Be prepared, because it is off for mostly this whole episode as well. You said it ain't a problem, though, remember? Huh? It ain't a problem, though, remember? Like you said, it ain't a problem. D- did I say that? Yeah. You said, it ain't no problem, brother. Helmet coming off. I don't mind it. They, I try, not, they got shot up his face. I so mean, okay. I didn't say that necessarily. What I said... You got what you wanted. What I said was, at this point, I just know... I know what it is. I know yeah. I know, I know. what it's like now. I'm, I'm you know, like, I'm not going to be upset every fucking week that he takes his helmet off, because at this point, I already... Yeah, that's how I, 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 I expect it. I told you that while I was watching it. Um... For me, watching this episode, um, I will say, like I said, yeah, I mentioned some good points. Episode one was more action based, which had me, which had my my like, which had my my attention. Um, this episode was more, like I said, story based, world building, character building, also backstory. Just giving Master Chief more backstory and more um, of why he is the way he is. You know what I mean? And how he questions his own motives now. His um, his his his, his like whole. Uh, what's his side of this war and everything like that? You know what I mean. So, um, I enjoyed it actually. I'm not gonna lie. Actually, I'm more intrigued now to hear more, about, like learn more about the story. Seeing we have um, what's the girl? The, the one you said the human gonna fight no, them people, her people, the ones they took that took her in. Hmm? What do they call the people that took uh, her in? Oh, the covenant. Yeah, the covenant. <laughs> seeing more of the covenant and seeing like what they're about. I'm just very intrigued to see more of the episodes now. So like, I'm, I'm into. I, I really like the black guy. I'm sorry, Soren. His friend, I think that's going to be a character that comes back into play. And then I'm glad that the girls finally separated from him for a little bit. Yeah, because I didn't need this Mandalorian. <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, I kind of wanted some separation where, like, okay, let's get some Master Chief stuff where we ain't got to worry about the, protecting, the, the, her, protecting her. You know what I mean? So I'm glad they did split them up for a little bit. If you want to bring her back, that's fine. But they will probably bring her back. But I'm glad they split up for a little bit. 
to just give Master Chief his time to shine. Because he, he hasn't really had no moments because he's been with her most of the like, first episode. Yeah. He, like, the first couple minutes and stuff like that. But So I'm glad he did that. Um, oh, we also got to see, like, a look at that one... Um, I forgot what his name is, but like, or what he, he is, but you know the guy that was on the TV in the first episode, like the interview, like he actually took over the call. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. he took over and killed all the people and stuff. Yeah, he kind of ruthless, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He's like, yeah, he's like they basically really trying to get old girl like tell everybody, oh yeah, all good, it's all good. So yeah. like, basically, you know, he's they basically just like some raiders. So as you're watching the show, you're kind of like, damn, like the only good people in this show is probably like Master Chief and. Well, that's like, why he's cut. That's why he's like, kind of like you're like, uh, well. He's even like they're like damn like low key where do I stay on this stuff? Yeah. You know what I mean, I think I might be how the doctor feels too after a while. Yeah, well I don't because I, I don't ever remember the game like the USNC uh, or UMNC whatever you know their their organization or their government is. I don't ever remember them being like this cruel you know and ruthless. But yeah, you know, maybe that's a change. Um, and then they also mentioned Cortana. I know she was a very big part of the games. Um, she's like the artificial intelligence that they use for the Spartans. So yeah, she looks cool. Yeah, yeah I mean, she don't like she don't come with some problems. So. They they gonna bring her in. So which I I actually question because you know Master Chief he's starting to question himself and I wonder if that's gonna like reset him back to you know current like old Master Chief like yeah modded Master Maybe. Chief you know I mean they're trying to get them up for rebooted yeah um but overall this show's been interesting man it's very much I think for you hardcore fans of Halo I think. I'm curious to hear more what y'all say. I mean, we have a friend named Tony who's a big Halo guy, so I'm curious to hear what he says. He hasn't had a chance to watch it when we talked to him last week. <laughs> but I'm curious to hear what you guys say, like what the hardcore um, fan base feels about this show. Yeah. You know what I mean? For me, as an outsider who ain't really in this community or really, you know, as involved in this game like that, um, I I think it's okay. I think it's cool. Like, I mean, I'm I'm going with it and just to see where it goes. It's like that. I don't have much expectation either, though. Either I'm not really like hardcore into it, but I'm just curious to hear more of what other people have to say. I know they do a YouTube thing also, like after it was yeah. a discussion and stuff like I might, that. I might need to start tuning in. Yeah, into I might that. check it out one time to see what they talking about in there, see what people commenting and stuff like that. So, mm-hmm. um, but the show looks yeah. solid visually. I'll give it that. The like, visuals, it's really, yeah. looks really nice. So, I was, um, and yeah, yeah, it also looks amazing. The worlds look cool, like the world building. It's like I already said, like you have some unique stuff. How they did, like the it kind of reminded me of Star Wars in the way how they did, like that dude's planet. Mm-hmm. Cause like how it's like the rocks and like the, the wires sticking to the rocks. Yeah, and that yeah. Stuff. Like, so kind of like some Star Wars type stuff, which is cool. That was dope. Um, Master Chief is dope, man. The guy playing him doing a great job. I just wish he had the helmet on more, but I'm not trying. I'm not gonna go on that for a whole rant. I'm just yeah. saying like. See him put the helmet on at the end. It was like, oh damn, he put the helmet back on finally. It was like, mm-hmm. is, is that a different intimidation? It made you really like realize you're watching like Halo. Yeah, you know I, mean? I think without the helmet, you forget like you can really forget that like I'm watching Master Chief right now. This is Halo. You know what I mean? So I mean, I just think of it a perspective like from their perspective, they're trying to you know humanize him in a way. I mean, obviously, it's not gonna sit right with a lot of Halo fans and you know people who mm-hmm. are familiar with Master Chief. But again, the show's trying to you know give give all these characters that they bring in uh, pr- uh you know specific personality said they took some inspiration from mando yeah uh, you could say that um especially the way he is outside of the helmet like he's kind of like a stiff like you know yeah by the rule by the book um and even like like they're like i understand the way this show is made why he takes his helmet off i mean obviously like when Soren brings him to his damn wife and kid. Obviously, you know, yeah, he's, he's of a friend. That makes sense. You know, you don't want to spook the kid all, off. You know, the kid might have thought that she was cool. He probably would. I would think it was cool, but hey, still, you don't want to spook the kid off. And you know, I guess it's just more that familiarity and just that sense of like being comfortable. I don't know. Yeah, but seeing him without the mask versus with the mask. Um, but yeah. Yeah, this is way more of an episode full of dialogue and just story, like trying to build the stories in the world. Because like now, like John mentioned, we have a little girl that's with the Covenant coming to try to find him now. And mm-hmm. I think she, I wonder where she gonna be. I wonder if she like she'll fall in love with him and maybe like him or something like that. Or, like oh, hey. she's trying to kill him. <laughs> hey, yeah, she might realize like oh, I like I like 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 him or something like that. She might realize like I like being around the humans or something. I'm a, I don't know. I'm gonna laugh if um you know that like she's a very important character in the game and like she's his villain in the game and then people are gonna comment on this video like what the fuck was that idea <laughs> like yeah, yeah i don't right know guys. Nah, but we don't know i don't, I don't know. know i ain't trying to like be an ass i just don't know like yeah. i'm just cute i'm just going with like like other people don't know about this shit so yeah she cute though i ain't gonna lie just saying you know she she'd be speaking that tone that that good that language I think the doctor looks prettier. Kind of, kind of, kind of sexy. You I know? prefer the doctor. Like, ooh, you know. I prefer the goddamn doctor. Now she's cool. She's the cool. doctor. Mm-hmm. 
Are you talking about the the daughter or the the, the doctor, the damn oh, the, the, the sparring doctor, the one that takes them sparring, the, uh, the scientist. My bad, not doctor, scientist. Damn, dude, I would rank. I'll rank. That's me. The though. daughter of the doctor, you know, the black chick. Then I'll rank covenant chick. Then, then Spartan I'll scientist. Put, I'll put Spartan scientist. Nice. Yeah. Degrading women on live. Crazy. I mean, it's not degrading. No, it's not degrading women. Yeah, we just play. Yeah, we pray. Um, yeah, yeah, all beautiful women. Uh, great. The cast has been solid. I've enjoyed everybody in the cast, honestly. So yeah, I can't complain about nobody, honest. Besides that, so agreed. Uh, definitely be back next week watching it again. Comes out on what Tuesdays? Uh, it's a Tuesday show, ain't it? When no Thursdays, I think Thursdays. Okay, yeah. so we'll be back again Thursday or Wednesdays. Know. Wednesdays. Wednesday, Wednesday nights going into the okay. It got it got, it got to get that view at the moon night. Yeah. Moon night got to get that first view first. Yeah, yeah. oh that. for sure, for sure. So this definitely put on the bat burner when it comes to moon yeah, night. yeah, yeah. But nah, for sure, it was um, a solid episode. I give it, if I had to rate the episode, I don't have to rate the first one. Uh, it's an eight out of ten for me. Eight out of ten. Okay, I think yeah, the first one seven point nine, eight out of ten, something like that. Yeah, the first one was probably like a. I'd probably say eight and a half, and this one's probably like an eight. So the first one for me was like a. 7.98 also. Okay. I think about the same. Yeah. But I will say I enjoyed the story more about this one, but I enjoyed the action so much of the last, last one. Last one, I was yeah. Like, you know what I mean? So. so, if they find a way to combine both of them. Well, I'm, sure it, episode, the, I'm yeah. sure it would on the road. I don't know how long the season's going to be, but I'm sure they're going to definitely combine on the road. Yeah. yeah. They put a lot of money into this show. We'll probably Shit, get season you two. see how much the budget is for each fucking episode? Yeah. <laughs> you tell. They put the money in. It looks Damn. good. You know what I mean? We knew it was going to come. Yeah. It's um, their baby right now. It's Paranormal's baby. Oh, for sure. For sure. That's their pride and joy. That's their. Mm-hmm. That's their. Um, what's called main attraction yeah um but yeah let us know your thoughts on halo the series down below in the comments section um feel free to school us on halo because again we're not too familiar with it um but yeah i also say some dumb shit low key like what i also say hey bro they gonna change that man's colors on his outfit who Hey, uh, Master Chief. No, he never changes. No, you're not a Bill Gates. You can change the colors of the Bill game. You won't change Master Chief. You're, when you're when you're playing the game, I think you're playing. No, wait, are you Master Chief in the game? I don't know. I thought you're Spartan. Damn, I can't remember. You're a random Spartan. No, I, I think you're, I think you're a random Spartan. You, when, you well, play, when you're playing the story, you're Master. Chief. Oh yeah, that's the one we played. Like the, me and you and David used to play. At home. Oh yeah, you can change colors, but that's because we're random Spartans. So oh yeah, okay, never mind. Man. Yeah, in the story mode, you're Master Chief. You can't change your colors. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. Okay, I'm making sure. So they need to bring some Spartans with some cool ass. Got be kind of tight. That would be. I need to see the damn sword again. The energy sword. But that too. Go ahead, close um, the sound fine. Yeah. But uh, yeah, let us know your thoughts on Halo, the series, down below. And if you enjoyed this review slash discussion, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and be sure to share. All right, you guys. I'm DeAndre. I'm Javante. And this is Dre and Jay. Deuces. Oh, 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 o